Hi, my name's Mike Dennis. I'm the new centre manager for our exciting new science centre in Headington, which will open sometime in 2019. I'm going to share um, some Satsuma science with you today. Satsuma is something I remember from when I was a child at Christmas, um, and there's quite a cool demo that you can do, which might get you talking around the Christmas table. So I've got two Satsumas here. Make sure they're fresh. I'll tell you why that's important later. And I've got two glasses of water here. Make sure they're big enough to put a satsuma in. I'm going to peel one of the satsumas very carefully, like this. Oh, I love the smell. Doesn't that make you think of Christmas or where you get more year round now? Um, and then my challenge for you is I'm going to, in a minute, I'm going to drop one in here. I'm going to drop one in here. Will they both float? Will they both sink? Will one sink? Will one float? I'd like you to talk to somebody about that now and see what you think. So if you pause the video at that point and then start again when you've had a discussion, I'll show you what happens. I'm assuming you've done that now, so here we go. If I put the um, one with the skin on, it floats. Is that what you expected? If I put the one without the skin on, it sinks. Is that what you expected? I wonder if you would pause again and just talk to somebody about why that might have happened. So I'm guessing you've talked about why it might have happened now. Let me tell you some of the things I know. There are several reasons. One of the reasons is that if you look at the Satsuma at the bottom here, there's a big pocket of air right in the middle. It just goes through the middle of the Satsuma. If you've got a really old Satsuma there, they're rather shriveled, so that doesn't, that doesn't work and it doesn't float so well. So that's one of the things um, that means it's not as dense and it floats better in water. Um, another thing is that your um, skin acts a bit like a life jacket. So the skin is not very dense and also you've got this pith um, which is really full of air. And so that's another thing which is making a difference. But once again, if you've got an old Satsuma, that tends to be rather shriveled and not work as well. There's a cool follow-on you can do to this. I'm going to show it you now. It doesn't always work. Um, and I've just been out and bought a lemon and a lime because lemons and limes don't always do the same thing. So have a little discussion. Which one of them will float? Which one will sink? Perhaps they'll both float. Perhaps they'll both sink. And we'll have a look. So let's see which one's going to float and which one's going to sink. So the lemon, that's definitely floating. Let's have a look at the lime. Interestingly, in this case, the lime also floats. Did you see it didn't float to the surface so quickly? And sometimes you can put a lime in and it will go down to the bottom. The reason for that is to do with the pith. If you look carefully at the pith, cut open your lemon, cut open your lime, you'll see there's a lot more pith and air in there than there is with the lime. 